back. Uh, I'm the Radio Geek and we are going to be smoking something today and today we're going to smoke some sides. I mean you've got ribs, you've got meatloaf, you've got brisket, you got, you've got to have some sides. So today we're going to give you a, something kind of sweet yet savory at the same time. We're going to smoke some sweet potatoes and also smoke a regular baker potato because my wife really is not too keen on, on sweet potatoes. And how do we do this? Really, it's quite, uh, quite simple. This video is going to go very, very quickly. And what's going to come out are some beautifully smoked and soft and tasty sweet potatoes and baker potatoes. It's, uh, well, why don't we just prep it, get going, and see what happens. Oh, mail's arriving. Okay, now first we have to slice the sweet potatoes. What we're going to do is cut them about, well, I'm not supposed to do that. Cut them about an, uh, three quarters of the way down so that they'll fan out. About an eighth of an inch across or so, maybe a little more. And I cut all the way through, but that's all right. You'll just stick it back together, put it in the pan, put it in the smoker, and let them rip. Ingredients will get that in there, and also the smoke. That's what you really want to have happen. So, we use this. You may be wondering what it is. It's melted butter and a teaspoon of pumpkin spice, pumpkin pie spice. Yeah, isn't that crazy? Just kind of spread, get it down inside as best you can. And before you know it, I'll get a brush and do that, works better. You're going to have some sweet potatoes ready for the smoker. Okay, now that we've got them bathed with their uh, butter and Pumpkin pie spice ingredients. We're gonna sprinkle some salt. You gotta have salt on potatoes. Come on, you know how that works. And you also notice this is my 13 inch pan that I bought for the uh, ribs that was too big for the smoker with the lid on. It's fine without it. So this is what they'll cook in. And same with the uh, baked potatoes. So there we go, we're all set to put this baby in the smoker and get things going. Okay, we do the exact same thing with the baked potatoes. You fan them out so you have a nice little opening between all these pieces. And then we're going to season them a little differently because these are baked potatoes rather than the sweet potatoes. We're gonna start with butter. You get butter down in there. Some melted butter from the microwave or you can do what I did with the sweet potatoes and soften it all day. I took that stuff out this morning. Just brush it down inside. Get it nice and buttery on top. Then we're going to add some salt. Get them down in there. Then some brown, ground pepper. And just because we like it so much, we're going to put some of our St. Elmo seasoning on top. So that's ready to go now too. We just put it in the other 13 inch pan lined with aluminum foil and we're ready to cook. Okay, we're all prepped and ready to go. Uh, it's quite simple really. I got the idea for the sweet potatoes from uh, the Gorilla Girl, the Gorilla Grill, she has a smoker and showed the method of uh, cutting the sweet potatoes and getting them ready. Figured we'd do the exact same thing with the baker. And what they're gonna do is they're gonna come out creamy, they're gonna come out soft, gonna come out very easy to chew because easy to chew, just like golf, is what old people do, old people do, old people do. Golf and soft foods, it's what old people do. Okay, it started to smoke and we're up to 235. There's no real need to wait until it gets preheated. You can put them in as soon as the smoke starts. Now, you'll notice that my cool little trays do indeed now fit. That's incredible. So the sweet potatoes are in. And now the same deal with the uh, bakers. There's one big potato here. It's gonna go on this rack. Close it up and in about an hour. We'll come out and we'll baste it with some more of their sauces, the butter for the uh, potato and the uh, butter and pumpkin pie spice for the sweet potatoes. So we're on our way. 
So it's going to take you four, five, six hours to cook any meat, really. You know, that's the way it works with your slow cooker. That's the reason low and slow, baby. So what you want to do is time your potatoes. Two hours is a good target. Give yourself maybe three. Give the potatoes a chance to really soften up because the lower the temperature, obviously, the longer it's going to take. Toward the end of this, we'll boost it to uh, 275, which is the maximum temperature on my master built electric smoker and let them soften up a little bit more. So that's it. There's not much left to show. So let's just check them out and see how they did. And there it is. They're all nicely smoked, soft as can be. You got your sweet potatoes in the back and your regular baked potato in the front all smoked delicious and it goes very well with two petite steaks Ooh! so there you have it smoked sweet potato and a smoked baker absolutely delicious i hope you'll try it and i hope you too will enjoy it and now today's special treat i'm a radio geek so i've been collecting commercials for quite some time this particular commercial is one of my favorites, comes from WFMS. We ran it probably 10, 11, 12 years ago. Darren Tandy was doing the Love Song show at night. Country Lovin' is what it was called. And he had an endorsement deal with Church's Collision Service. This spot ran accidentally. I didn't hear it before it got on the air, otherwise it wouldn't have made it. And let me just say, that my uh, operations manager, program director, was none too happy with me Monday morning after this ran all weekend long. So here you go. I've learned over the years what it takes to mend a broken heart. But when it comes to ding doors and chip paint jobs, I yield way to the experts at Church Brothers Collision Repair, where accidents unhappen. Today, one of their repair experts is going to give us some romantic safety tips. Hello. In the state of Indiana, it is illegal to make coitus in or on an automobile. However, that does not stop many of its citizens. So if one must engage in coitus in or on an automobile, please follow these helpful tips. 1. Coitus should not be practiced on the hood of an automobile. Choose the trunk of the car. It is much sturdier. 2. Do not make coitus in a moving vehicle. We cannot stress this enough. 3. According to actuarial tables, the 1982 Olds 98 is the safest for coitus. Thanks for the advice. If your car is banged up, you know who to call. Church Brothers Collision Repair. Downtown, Castleton, Greenwood, Zionsville, and Avon. Accidents unhappen. Yeah, that was good, wasn't it? Coitus. Let's look it up. Whew. So anyway... Thanks for joining me today. We'll be making some chicken quarters coming up. I'm going to try to recreate the recipe that they use at the Canfield Fair in Canfield, Ohio. The Ruritan Club has some delicious open pit chicken that we're going to try to recreate in the smoker. So that's coming up. We're also going to be doing a brisket, and we're also going to be doing a pork butt because that's what you do with a smoker. Thank you for joining us, and we'll see you next time.